Hello there, welcome, this is Alex, and if you're starting Mortal Shell and want to make everything vastly harder or somewhat easier from the immediate start, I'm going to show you how to do both within the first five minutes of the game. First off, if you want this cool looking blackened character, well, you must choose to sever connection with all of your shells, meaning that you'll have to continue through the game with a tiny health pool, but you at least get a huge chunk of stamina. You will pretty much be dying in just one hit with this optional challenge, so highly highly not recommended for your first playthrough. Or if you're trying to prove something, go right ahead. Now to get to this from the very start, you'll need to continue down this path till you reach the open area with your little hub base across the way and hang an immediate right. At the next intersection, take a left. Once you hit the water, take a right and watch out for those poison kermits. Take the next left, and a quick right, and then you will see this somewhat hidden hole you can crawl through, head through there, then you will be at the shrine where you can activate the quote unquote hard mode, good luck with that one, honestly. Now for anyone who might be struggling with the early game instead, if you haven't found this shell yet, well let me introduce Eridrim the Venerable. This shell class can make the game quite a bit easier in a way, since this guy can take a huge beating thanks to his maxed out durability stat. His downside is his low stamina, which is somewhat of a penalty, but his huge HP bar more than makes up for that, since it gives you a little more time to figure out enemy attack patterns and actually learn a little quicker. If you want to go grab this at the very start, at the first split, actually take a left to pick up the first shell class, which will make this short run a little easier. Continue down this path till you reach the opening straight across from your home base with the big bell on top of it, and then take a right. Take a left at the next fork, and then a quick left again before you hit the water. Up this path, you'll start to see some strange stones, and then you'll be taking a left at this point. Continue down this for a while, and then take a right at the fork. Keep going straight through all these enemies until you start to reach a big wide open area. Here you'll want to take the stone steps downward till you reach the bottom, and then your new shell will be eagerly awaiting you hunched down against this rock. This guy should really help you out, especially towards the start, and if you're not using the stamina hungry Big Martyr's Blade, you can actually do pretty well in the late game as well. That's pretty much it, two quick ways to either help or hinder yourself from the very start of Mortal Shell. Let me know if you found this to be helpful at all, and also go check out my other videos on Mortal Shell if you want some more useful stuff, specifically on the combat and the weapons. As always, this has been Alex, and good luck with those dodge rolls. Have fun.